Have you been noticing that people are giving you death stares lately? You know, people are looking at you with eyes of envy. People are looking at you and they're hating hard on you. You could feel it, okay? People are looking at you, they're cocking their heads, they're looking in your direction and they're shooting you looks. If looks could kill, these are the types of looks that they were talking about. These people are glaring at you with, the, with hatred, with envy, with anger, with contempt. They're looking at you and they're hating everything about you. But at the same time too, they want to be like you, right? But they just can't get there. So they're shooting daggers at you. There are going to be some people who are more covert with showing how they feel about you. They're not going to be upfront. They may come around you and they're going to be smiling. They're going to be vibing, but it's all fake. It's a, it's a ruse, right? It's not really who they are around you. They really hate you, but at the same time, they're jealous of you, but you know, they're being quiet about it. They're not trying to make it known. They don't want you to know. This is how they continue this vicious inner cycle of hating on you and feeling inadequate in their own lives. It's always going to continue this way and they keep it hidden, covert. But there's others who are the opposite, okay? These are the people that come around you and they can't hide their contempt for you. They can't hide their hatred for you. So they're going to be the ones who are shooting you daggers. They're just glaring at you. They're watching you. They're cocking their heads to look at you like they're showing you how much they don't like you in their space right now. That's what they're going to show you. That's what they're pretty much trying to tell you with their eyes. Like, you shouldn't be here. You shouldn't be around, you know? They're going to they're gonna give you these evil, angry glares. And you're feeling, you're looking to yourself like, I'm not doing anything. This person's being triggered by you. You're unintentionally triggering these people. They don't know how to act around you. But one thing for sure is that they can't hide how much they hate you. They have to look at you in some type of way. They have to look at you and glare at you. And, you know, they're just, they're, they're angry. They're mad. They're very, very mad that you're there. And they can't hide it. Your presence is just so strong. They can't even be covert about it. They need to show you right there how much they don't want you around, right? These death glares start happening when you start glowing up. These are the stares that you need to start getting used to. You're not always going to get the praise and the claps and the admiration and the people looking up to you. They're not going to be so forthcoming with that energy. There's going to be some people who are going to try to kick you down. <laughs> That's the bottom line. People are going to try to kick you down rather than trying to help you build to a higher point. That's just what they're going to do. They're going to give you the death stares because they want you to feel like you have something to worry about. Like you have to worry about them or you have to stop what you're doing to check on them. It's all a ruse. It's all a ruse. These people are giving death stares because they want you to notice them. They know that you're going to notice that. So they're doing it. One, because they really do hate you. And two, they want you to give them attention. You're a star. <laughs> You're literally a star to them. So they need your attention. You're like a local celebrity. That's really what it's like. So it's like when these people are giving you death stares, they're doing it because they really need your attention. They know you're important. They know you're working on important things. So of course, when they come, when you come around them, and they have this hatred and jealousy at the same time, but at the same time too, they have this admiration. They're going to be giving you the death stares. They want you to come over and address them and talk to them and give them attention because they don't feel important. You make them feel important. You make them feel like their lives are interesting. You're interesting to be around. That's, that's what it is. You're interesting to be around. You have an energy that everyone kind of vibes with. Everybody likes you. Most people like you, but it's the people who don't have nothing going for themselves. You know, they're not in a good headspace. These are the people that will hate you the most. These are your enemies, family, friends, coworkers, neighbors, uh, you know, exes, <laughs> teachers, right? Anybody could do this to anybody else right? But 
you'll get these dead stares. You'll get these people just watching you and looking at you with, a, with in a menacing fashion. You know, they want you to know, like, you know, they're hard. They're really gonna, you know, they have it out for you. They want you to feel something, <laughs> but you got to shake it off. Just shake it off because it's all a ruse. They know what they're doing. They know you're important. You have important places to be. You got important things to work on. They don't have nothing of the sort for themselves. They need your attention. They crave your attention. They're looking at you with these death stares because they want you to feel intimidated by them. But they're acting out. It's like a toddler. You're way ahead of them. You're way ahead. You're way more advanced. They're not thinking about how far your mind goes. You're way too advanced for these sort of people. <laughs> they think these death stares are like, you know, this is Tron or something. This is real life. It is what it is. Like people are going to look at you with death stares and death glares because their lives are dreary. They have no hope. They have nothing that wor they're working towards, working on. They have no goals. They're living off other people. They're scamming. They're doing all the wrong things. They know it. They want to break your spirit. They're going to give you death glares. <laughs> they want you to feel scared. They want to feel powerful. They want to make it seem like you should fear them. They fear you. It should never be twisted. They fear you. They fear what you will do to them. <laughs> How you'll make them feel. They shiver in your presence. Some of them really do. Yup. <laughs> so this is why people will give you death stares, man. Keep an eye out on those death stares and understand it's a ruse. You're probably a good person with a lot to give to the world. And just giving you death glares, is that's their way of trying to exert a form of dominance over you but it will never work you're way ahead way ahead they just don't understand you you're way way ahead of these people okay your headspace is clear they're confused <laughs> they don't even know how to act they're acting like it's tron and they're shooting you daggers they're trying to kill your spirit but they will never you're way ahead you're way ahead. So I hope you guys like my video about death stares, <laughs> getting death stares from haters. I hope you guys have a wonderful weekend and have an awesome day. Okay, thank you. Bye.